My name is Byron Hughes with the Aerotrol Technical Support Team. I'm going to show you how to install an RS-1000 rain sensor to a controller. In this case, it's going to be a quick dial. First thing that we're going to need to do is we're going to need to take the receiver out of the package and we're going to route the wires inside of the controller through one of the holes in the bottom of it. Once we have the wires routed inside of it, we're going to use the two red wires are for the 24 volt power source. So we're going to install them onto the 24 volt board by loosening up the screws on the 24 volt side we're going to be able to slip in both of these wires to apply the 24 volts to the receiver The other two wires that we're going to install is the white and the brown wire directly to the sensor ports. So we have to remove the jumper first and insert the brown and the white wire which is normally closed position. And there is no polarity, so it doesn't matter which one goes to the right or to the left. So now that we have the sensor installed, we can switch it to the active mode. And we know that the sensor is dry at this point, and all we're seeing is the time and day. We remove the cover once you remove the cover from the receiver we can see that we have a power light on so we successfully installed the rain sensor to the controller in our next segment we're going to learn how to set it up and make it work